programming that return a value uh, that return a value okay like uh, uh, if you doing any uh, like uh, programming computer programming it return a value by evaluating any of the given expression like uh, whatever uh, in the given expression means uh, uh, in the expression uh, after that getting a value but this is operator okay so operator is the object that uh, in the computer programming return a value by ev evaluating like expression okay uh, we are discussing uh, after uh, discussing the operator we are discussing what is expression also okay so operator uh, is uh, classified into following type it's like uh, assignment operator assignment operator Assignment operator, next one we have arithmetic operator. Arithmetic operator. Okay. So next one we have comparison operator. Comparison operator. And next one we have logical operator. Logical operator. Okay, so we have to uh, discuss one by one what is assignment operator, what is arithmetic operator, what is comparison operator, and what is logical operator. Okay. In that, I have discussed. Okay, it's one more than that. I will divide it into uh, like three column. Okay. In that we have beginning. We have operator. And in the operator, wait. It's our shortened operator. Short hand. Let's wait, wait. We'll do one thing. Okay, I will return at first operator. What is the operator right there? We have assign assignment. Assignment operator and we have addition addition. Additional assignment operator. Assignment addition wait. Addition assignment. Okay. Next one we have subtraction. Subtraction assignment. Assignment. Okay. Next one multiple. We have the multiple. Multiple assignment. Okay. I will do one thing. Okay. And next we have like uh, division. Division assignment. Assignment. Okay. And next one we have reminder assignment and exponent exponent assignment. Wait. Let me drag into that one. Oops. Reminder. Reminder assignment. Wait. Reminder assignment. Assignment. Wait. Okay. And next one we have, I will define in the below of that. It's like a exponent. Exponent. Okay. These are the operator we have. 
at first I have to divide it into row that look better wait selected one okay let's operator in the operator we have assignment operator okay in that we have additional assignment operator okay it's subtraction assignment the next one we have multiple assignment operator and uh, next one we have divide division assignment wait it's division okay so next one we have wait next one we have exponent assignment operator these are the belong to assignment operator okay I will do one things. I will do mark on that wait. Okay, it look fine now. I will mark on that. It's wait. It's the assignment operator. These are the assignment operator we have. So in that we have sort and method. Okay. Wait. Sort and method. sort and method decrease the size of that it's 12 okay it's better look better uh, method is sort and method wait sort hand method okay i think you it's visible you okay we have uh, next what is the sort end of it we have to discuss and in that assignment what are the sort uh, like sort end operator is that yeah it's coming now you to drag in that Okay. So x I imagine we have example of that it's x equal to y. The y is assigned the value of x. Okay. And next uh, next one we have uh, we have to discuss that one also. Before that we have to all these things sorry and operator. What is the additional? It's x plus x plus equal y. It is the sorted operator of additional assignment operator. Okay, guys. So next one we have um, x minus equal y. Is that like sorted operator of subtraction assignment operator? Okay. Next we have multiple assignment operator. We have to discuss those things. Next one we have multiple. Uh, a streak, a streak, yeah, why okay? It is the sort and method of multiple assignment operator. Okay, next one we have divided division assignment operator, it's like x, y. Okay, next one we have reminder assignment operator, reminder assignment operator okay and next one we have exponent Ex you know that what is all exponent i will uh, discuss uh, already but after i after that uh, uh, assignment finish i will discuss all these like what is the exponent okay you know that what is the uh, as plus uh, subtraction uh, multiplication division and reminder you know that already i think uh, next we have to discuss what is the meaning of that okay it's meaning okay so x is x, x equal to uh, like x equal to y means x will be assigned 
the value of y okay wait fine x equal y okay so next one is x plus equal y means x x equal x plus y okay it means additional assignment it will be fine x plus y means we have to return the sorted method but its meaning is x, x equal to x plus y no need to uh, like uh, return that x equal to x plus y we are returning in that x plus equal y okay the same meaning of both are same meaning okay and uh, like we have to uh, do the mathematical operation in that also it will be written the same value in that okay it's like uh, x wait, x and x equal x minus y okay and next one we have x equal x multiplication y it's asterisk okay asterisk in that and we have divided it's x equal to x divided by y okay let's say division assignment operator okay reminder operator it's the same also it's x equal uh, like x exponent the exponent is there yeah it's y okay next we have like uh, x x exponent y it need to be equal it's x uh, i will uh, define you that one wait it's x equal x exponent y wait. Uh, exponent y yeah. this one require wait i will remove that one whole part in that i have my issue it's like uh x exponent equal y okay these are the assignment operator okay so uh, uh no need to like uh, define x equal to x plus y you can uh design like x x x plus y x plus equal y equal like uh, whatever you have to assign the x also okay it's the meaning of certain the certain operator it is the meaning of that it is the operator okay any doubt you can ask me on the what is the uh, like assignment of what is operator i will define all these things and after that what is the assignment operator and what are, what are the uh, operator we have in the assignment operator and uh, what is the sortment uh, sort hand method in that and meaning of that i will already discuss with you okay so next we have to discuss uh, arithmetic operator arithmetic okay so i will remove that one oh one thing can do right any doubt in that like assignment operator you can ask me on that next one we have to discuss arithmetic operator okay arithmetic operator let's see what is the arithmetic operator we have before that part uh, like uh, always it will be written in the uh, like number okay it handle the number numerical value and always return a numerical value because it's a like arithmetic operator we always return value of that num numerical okay so in that let's see what is that like we have so first one is like what is the operator of the arithmetic operator is there its operator i will increase the value like font size okay it's to better operator okay and in that operator i will 
show you all these things. Wait, what is the out? Yeah, it's fine now. Okay, so it's uh, addition. We have addition operator in mathematical operator. Okay, so next one we have sub uh, like subtraction. Okay, it's subtraction, and I will do one thing is going to be written on that addition addition okay next one we have addition okay so it's subtraction subtraction okay so next one we have is multiplication it's asterisk given by asterisk it's multiplication okay multiplication and next one we have division 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 okay it's division next one we have like uh, exponent right exponent exponent okay so next one we have increment increment and decrement okay i hope you know that uh, what is increment decrement i will define all these things also don't worry about that Decrement, okay. The sign is like plus plus and minus minus. It's like plus plus increment and decrement. It's minus minus. Wait. Minus minus okay, it's a decrement operator. So we have to discuss uh, all these things. What is additional? You know that uh, it's addition, subtraction. It is the name of the description. Is the addition and subtraction, multiplication, division, exponent, and increment, decrement. So in that, uh, I will discuss like exponent, uh, increment, decrement more about that. Okay, in the practical, we have to see that one. So let's see. Okay, so we are linking that object dot js file in that HTML. Okay, so we are written the function in that its function fun cti one. Okay, function is like operator oper. Okay, this is my like function in that function. But first, I call that function. Okay, because I don't remember that one after. Uh, like return the function so i will uh, define a uh, variable it's a it's like uh, 10 okay so variable b it's like 20 okay so at first i'll show that uh, like c variable c is like uh documents a plus plus okay let's print the b it's, uh in that we have b okay. yeah it's done b i need to paint the b in the back we are returning uh access that b okay in a is 10 in that 
uh, in the b value whatever b value it will it will be in, increased by 1 okay so let's see what is the value on that i will open in the live server Wait. okay it's uh, a b okay I hope you uh, already uh, already know that uh, assignment operator and arithmetic operator like uh, plus minus uh, like uh, multiplication division exponent exponent I will define that but uh, these many are in, try yourself okay I will just uh, dis like describe you all these like uh, what is the post increment what is pre increment for post decrement for pre, -de pre decrement and what is exponent and uh, and division uh, multiplication uh, uh, like addition in you can do that it's a easy process not a like hard okay. wait it's opening now yeah it's open now It's open, but answer is not coming. Okay. Let's see what is the error in that. Yeah, it's document is not a function. Okay, document dot write need to be printed. Okay, it's working fine, I think. Yeah, it's working fine. It's 10. Have you observed that? It's 10 now. And what is the value of A? We have to define like, like that one also. Let's see. It's like A. Do you observe that one? It's 11 now. Wait, I will show you that one. B, R. It will break that. Okay, it's 11, 10. Have you observed that it's printed A is the first one, is 11. But B is like 10. Why it's 10? Because it will be uh, after uh, like changing the value, it will be assigned to the A. Okay, I will define what is the plus plus minus minus. And have you observed that this plus plus means it will be increment by one. Okay, so at first it will be assigned the whatever value you, uh, like A have, it will be assigned to the B. After that, it will be changes the value. Okay, but uh, it's a post increment. I will show you what is a post increment, pre increment before that is like wait wait yeah so i will discuss with you first what is post increment and pre increment post increment okay post increment means like a or a plus plus a plus plus okay and post like uh, p decrement p increment p increment means plus plus a what is the difference between that i will uh, define you at first then i will show you in the practical also have you observed that uh, we had uh, like uh, uh, written that a plus plus and it will be at first assign the value after changing the value and it will be affected on the initial value okay but in the pre increment as at first it will be change the value and as after assign the value let's see i will show that one 
you will be understand better it's the have you observed that this is the a is 10 and after that at first a is assigned to the b after it will be increment okay but when i return that a plus a plus plus a at first it will be assigned that value if you do that, it will be assigned to the value and A also changing because A, A now A is um, value of A is 11. It will be increment by 1. So in that like plus plus A, it will be increment at first, then it will be changed, uh, assigned to the and change also. Okay, But A plus plus means it will be assigned at first to the B. After that, he changes by increment by 1 and assign the value of A. If you observe that one, it's 11 and 10 and it's like uh, plus plus a it's level 11 have you observed that one i hope you understand increment what is pre increment and what is post increment please let me in the chat box then i will discuss the uh, what is the uh, post decrement and pre decrement Hello guys, are you there? Are you understand this pre increment and post increment? If not, uh, told me I will uh, describe you once again. Okay, Jana Gishab, whatever other, have you understand? Okay, Shomya. Okay, Shrija. Okay, Anand. Okay, Rashmita. Okay, Kedreshwar. Uh, what about Banshi and Minakshi? Uh, okay, okay, great. So next we have to discuss like uh, post decrement, decrement, and pre decrement, pre decrement. Okay, it's like. Uh, A minus minus okay, it's post decrement pre means first and post means after that value okay it's minus minus it will be at same like concept it's up like increment decrement let's see I will define you that for first I will show you in the uh, post decrement minus minus let's see it is 10, it's 9. Have you observed that one? At first, it will be assigned the value. Whatever uh, a, uh, what, whatever value of A, it will be assigned to the B. After it changes the value, it is decreased uh, decrease by uh, like 1 and it will be assigned to the A. Okay. But in that uh, like uh, pre increment, uh, pre decrement, sorry, pre decrement, it will be at first change that, uh, decrease the value of 1. And it will be assigned to the B. After that, it will be assigned the value of A. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Any any doubt in that? Anyone? Who is that? Hello. Can you hear me, guys? Yeah, my voice is audible. Okay. Okay, let's see. It's minus minus one means it it will be uh, like a uh, decrement by one. After it will be assigned the value of uh, a into b, and it will be change value of a also. Okay, if you observe that it's like uh, I will show you in that like a breakpoint using breakpoint. I will see you on that to it. The inspect we have a conjure in the one source file. Okay. In that we have minus minus a. Okay. So let I will break the point in that. It is a break point. Okay. So let's see. Have you observed that one? It's 9 9, but uh, when I break the point in that.
it is 10 okay value of a is 10 after that it will be like uh, decrease my decrement by one and do that functionality okay if i do the breakpoint in that it will be like change according to that okay so i hope you understand uh, this like increment decrement as well okay post increment and post decrement and i will show you that uh, like export is exponent before that let's see it's like uh, uh 20 in that c i will print that one it's variable c it's like a component b i will to print that one i will print okay so i will print that one right It's working fine. What is the value of that? What is the value of that? Because we are uh, like doing that uh, uh, 10 and 20, na? it's 10 to the power 20. That's why it uh, like that much value is uh, 2 and uh, it's 3. Okay. 3 to the uh, 3 to the power 2. Okay. Component. It's 9. 3 to the power 9 means 3 into 3. Okay. It will be multiplied two times. That's why it's 9. Okay. If I give like uh, 10 to the power 100, we have that it's 100 now. Okay. So exponent means it's power. Okay. Before that, we have like, uh, I will show you that one. Before that, we have uh, math, math function. In that, like earlier, we have to. Um, Bring the exponent in the using math dot pow p o w okay. I will show that one right. We are using like uh, math dot p o w pow is power okay. It's number. What are the number you want to and uh, with the power of that p o w yeah okay. Power okay. We are using before the exponent uh, like in that uh, it is a previous version in the earlier version we are using method power example of that it's like uh, math dot pow in that we have mm, three or you have to define like uh, five it is the number and power of that at three let's see it's working fine or not If I if I want to print that this document dot right, I will do one thing. I will assign a value in that variable it be in that I have if I net dot pow in that two or five then that three. I want to print a B. Let's see, it's working fine or not. It may be not working because it will be deprecated, that's why it's not working. Maybe let's see if it's working or not. It's not working, okay. what is the error in that it's math is not defined okay i will do one thing it's m i think yeah, it's printed now it will work in okay still it's 125 but uh without writing that method power we can do that also like uh, i exponent p it will be printed the same also not, uh, do not uh, like uh, without using the method power we can do that it's a latest version it's a yellow version we have like in that met method power okay so these are the 
arithmetic operator and no need to describe like uh, plus and minus you know that uh, it's addition if you do the addition in that uh, uh, 5 plus 3 it's like 8 and 5 plus minus 2 and 5 into a uh, like uh, multiplication 3 it's 15 1 5 and divided by and um, and uh, what is the like mod modulus i think no no reminder it's reminder a reminder is like uh, it will describe okay i will uh is that like uh do that one thing so it's like what is that what is the division what is the uh, like reminder i will show you that one okay it's five by three what is that one point six 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 okay uh i will divide one thing so is like six uh, six by three okay six by three it's two now okay you that two and what is the reminder is that reminder like wait yeah zero if i divided by five it's maybe one two okay five three means three uh three three one three and uh, five minus three is two okay yes right okay i hope you understand uh, arithmetic operator and uh uh, like uh, what is that i will show you one thing also like uh, mm, what is that assignment of it i will show that one also you will understand better i think variable b in that i have to show in that it's okay wait i'll show you that one Okay, let's see. It's ten. I will print that document. Dot write. In that, I will do one things. I will uh, return a variable in that. Let's see. In that, I have written dead. Uh, sorry, it's a uh, a. And in that, we have. We are not discussing that one equal operator. Okay, okay. In that, okay. If I do that one thing is plus if I define uh, P equal E plus no A plus it's that like ten it will be defined like uh, ten plus A it's uh, in the twelve twenty sorry not ready right okay so next one we have to discuss what is the comparison operator okay uh, in that assignment in the arithmetic operator in doubt you can ask me here goes to the like uh, next one we have comparison operator we are already discussed that the comparison operator like equal not equal greater than greater than equal to less than equal to less than less than equal to and triple uh, equal what is the difference between uh, double equal one triple equal to, i will show you that one and uh, these are the comparison operator okay i will return on that you will be understand better i think it's fine okay next we have to discuss we have comparison operator in that comparison operator we, um, we know that it's like uh, less than greater than okay it's greater than equal to less than less than equal to okay equal equal and triple equal what is the difference between have show without one so we have not equal to the not equal okay in this one type are there okay less than less than equal to less, greater than greater, greater than equal to in that i have to if i know it's greater than
greater than greater than and next sum is greater than equal greater than equal to equal. and this one we have less than less than less than and next one we have for oh, the will okay it's less than it's less than equal to less than equal equal okay and next one we have equal equal uh, it's equal it's equal okay It's strictly equal. equal. Okay. Now, uh, what the difference between equal and the strictly equal means uh, in that uh, double equal, it will be allow the multiple like uh, that type. Means uh, if you define like uh, 10, it's a num numerical value, and you have to define like a uh, string value, like uh, in the double quotation you have to return like 10 it will be allowed to like equal but it's equal or not it will be show that one uh, if you like uh, uh, do that one thing says uh, if you return a triple equal to it will be required it will be uh, like uh, return the value is false because a strict equal is like uh, need to be like same data type if you defining a equal to like a, a 10 it's a numerical value and b also you have to define numerical not need to define like like string it is not uh, it will be false okay if you do uh, like defining in that in between that you have to return like triple equal to ne uh, equal and triple equal to difference is that equal is uh, like uh, allowed to uh, defend that data that, that type and uh, like uh, triple equal to not uh, allowed to uh, like uh, different data type it will be equal like equal uh, the same data type it allowed okay and not equal you know that uh, if uh, it's not equal equal it's not equal okay not equal i hope you understand these many things and before that i have to uh, like uh, show you the logical operator then we have to discuss what are the and uh, where we are using like equal not equal and that that things okay it is in that we have to discuss logical operator logical operator so what are the logical operator we have there we have like, yeah. logical end logical logical end yeah, done. logical end next one we have logical or okay. logical logical or okay. so next one we have logical nodes Yeah. Logical not. Okay. These are the logical operator. So in the uh, like tomorrow system we have to discuss logical operator. Before that, we are discussing uh, what is the like uh, greater than equal, like greater than uh, you know that, but I will define you like equal and strict equal. Okay.
in that we have to access the value of a we have to access the value of uh, c okay let's see what is the value of c this is not a function i think as to say is not defined okay we are Have you observed here, like uh, A B C? At first, it will be assigned that A B equal to A is A equal. Let's see, it's like A equal ten before that, and B is twenty. But now A is twenty because it will be assigned the value of uh, B into A. After that, whatever value uh, like uh, have in that A, it will be assigned the C. Okay, C is twenty now. Have you observed that one? Okay. Okay, I will show you that. Variable a, it's ten. Okay, uh, next we it's like uh, variable a. In that we have ten. Okay. If I need to be defined b. <laughs> different variable in that if a equal equal a equal equal b it will be so that document dot write equal is true okay true and next one we have else else in that we have discussed document right also also okay it's true have you observed that it's true why it's true because we are doing double equal if i return triple equal to It's false. Why it's false? Because we are returning number as a string. If I uh, remove that string, I return number. It will be so true. It's of that it's true now. Okay. So one things you uh, need to be remember. Like uh, I will already show you. If I uh, like uh, add the boolean value to boolean value, like boolean value plus boolean value, it will be return me a uh, boolean value. Okay. If I like uh, return a like In that number plus number, like numerical value and numerical value, it will be always uh, like uh, return a number value. You know that better. Okay. If I uh, like uh, uh, addition number numerical value to boolean value, it will be uh, return a number value because uh, boolean value have a like uh, have a particular value zero and one. Okay. And uh, if I like uh, addition the string and string, it will be assign me a string. Okay. Uh, return a value of string. If I like uh, addition a string to the number, it will be uh, always return me a string. Okay. I hope you understand what is equal, uh, equal, uh, equal, equal, and uh, triple equal. And in that, if I return like twenty, uh, in that I have to return not equal. If not equal, it will it will be uh, so mean that true. Okay. A B is not defined. What is that A B? It's true. Why it's true? Because a is not equal to b. A is not equal to b. If I return ten, it will be return false. False. Have you observed that one? Because ten is equal to ten, na. So it will be not return like true. Because it's not a equal to b. So a is not equal to b when then you have to print the document or write it's true. 
you it will be written true and otherwise it will be written false okay and other things you know that like uh, greater than equal to less than equal to you know that if you write in uh less than or greater than if i write uh, quantity it will be written okay greater than uh, less than and less than equal to greater than equal to we can do that okay so i hope you understand uh, what are the operator we have and uh, tomorrow onwards we have to discuss like uh, what is the logical operator and uh, we have other operator we have their special operator is there mm, next we have to discuss what is the expression okay so any doubt you can ask me in the chat box as well as you mute on mute yourself and ask me the doubt and Okay, what about other? Okay, great. Okay, guys. So I will uh, remind you uh, like one thing. Uh, whatever you do, the whatever the assignment uh, assigned to you in the classroom, it will be uh, like. Uh, Uh, always it will be seen that senior because you are doing well, always the assignment or not it will be affected by your uh, like uh, certificate entrance certificate so better uh, i know like inform you that always you have to finish that assignment because as per your finish i will uh, assign you new assignment on that and uh, and uh, all this report whatever you have to submit on the classroom it will be goes to the senior and senior will be uh, like uh, seeing you all the per uh, performance whatever you do that after that he will be uh, like awarded uh, something or uh, like you know that uh, like something uh, employee in that company organization any employee is doing well it will be like uh, awarded this employee so if you well uh, very well doing that uh, assignment after that you response always in the group group itself like always the senior will be uh, seeing the what uh, who uh, the guys is response always so always you have to response and uh, complete the assignment as per, as soon as possible because i know that uh, you have studied like btech uh, bc or mca uh, you have don't have that much time to like you have uh, other classes also so as soon as possible do that one because we have like sunday and we are saturday also so still you are not completing that one so i don't uh, uh, told you anything on that Okay, base basis or uh, basis of your assignment, it will be assigned whatever uh, like certificate, intensive uh, certificate given to you. Okay, so please uh, be response and always do that assignment at particular time. Okay, so if I like, uh, let's see, I will uh, in that uh, some guys are not uh, doing uh, like eleven, twelve, I think spending. But if I assign uh, like today, uh, today uh, task also, it will be uh, like a burden to you. Okay. so i will give you one day also i will not assign any task on the today uh, tomorrow on i on what i will give you assignment assign the assignment on that so please complete tomorrow on what tomorrow i will give you one day okay thank you so much have a good day bye